morning guys. It is currently 9.40 in the morning, Friday, May 13th. I hope you guys have had, actually you guys are watching us on Sunday, so I hope you guys had an awesome weekend. As you guys can tell from the title, it is going to be a full day of eating, so I hope you guys are excited for that. I am meeting up with Austin later today for a workout. I have a haircut at 12.45 today as well, so we're probably going to grab something to eat either before or after our workout. Uh, this morning, I don't have a lot going on. On days where I don't work at Nike or Fred Meyer, I like to actually hop on my computer right when I get up in the morning and get as much work done as possible, whether that's online clients, responding to emails, or YouTube comments. So I like to put in about an hour before I get super hungry in the morning, and then I like to go downstairs, grab something to eat, and then start the day. My macros for today, I'm not 100% sure on this, so I'm gonna put the correct macros on the screen, but I believe it's 250 protein, 105 grams of fat, and 610 grams of carbs around there. Oh, the one thing I wanted to touch up on too was my weigh-in this morning. I weighed in at 195.4 pounds, which is very, very exciting. I'm very happy with it. I honestly didn't expect to weigh in that high because you guys know in LA, I didn't have a scale for like, I think I didn't weigh myself for like almost the entire week. I'll see you guys downstairs for meal number one. <laughs> Okay, so right now I have two eggs in here, two servings of egg whites, two whole wheat English muffins, these are awesome, one serving of oatmeal, half a serving of almonds with a little bit of protein powder in there as well, just for flavor, and then I'm probably going to have like add a slice to each of these sandwiches, I'm making an egg sandwich by the way. So I'm going to do that and I'll check in with you guys once I actually have this all done. Look at his little tooth. <laughs> so cute, buddy. All right, guys, so this is meal number one. Oatmeal, serving of oats, and then I got eggs, egg sandwich right here, ton of eggs, way more than I thought would come out. I got 52 grams of protein in this meal, 21.5 fat, and 82 grams of carbs. It's a pretty well-balanced meal, very high in carbs, which is awesome. I'm gonna eat this outside, guys, because it's beautiful out here. Probably won't eat for another couple hours, either before or after my haircut, so I'll see you guys this afternoon. I'm gonna enjoy this. Peace. God, I really need to wash my car. That bird poop has been on there for like two weeks. I need to make that a goal. It's about 12.25 in the afternoon right now. I am on my way to the haircut appointment that is at 12.45, so I have 20 minutes to get there. I'm actually going straight to the gym after the haircut. Austin's meeting me at the haircut place, so I have everything packed. I have all my gym stuff right here. I got my pre-workout right here, and I'm pretty much ready to go. That's not good. All right, all my stuff's in his trunk. He wants to show you guys the. <laughs> oh, we're about to do like a donut around this roundabout, but then we just saw this guy doing some good stuff. He's still doing it. it. You kidding me? You think I'm gonna let that guy stop me? This guy's like. Oh yeah, he's confused. <laughs> no, they're just carbs. Yes. 2.20 in the afternoon. I'll show you guys my haircut real quick. This is what it looks like. I have no idea if it's gonna look good or not. Hopefully it looks good after I shower, we'll see. But here, we are at Noodles & Company. Austin got a massive meal. He's gonna be way over his fats, I'm sure, today. He got I don't think so. two pestos with double chicken on each one. So, what was it? We equaled it to like 1,700. 1,796, so. And he got a Rice crispy. so that's like 2,000 calories right here, I'm guessing. And for me, I went a little more conservative. Uh, total calories, 665 with this. I got added chicken, I got like Bangkok curry. It has like 75 grams of fat, probably about 30 grams of protein with the chicken, and then 25 grams of fat in total. That equals about 665 calories, guys. This is going to be our pre-workout meal. We're gonna eat this, head to the gym, back and arm day today, mostly arms, and I'll see you guys there. <laughs> He's a little full. <laughs> How do you feel? Give us an update. I'm glad I'm not wearing a belt today. <laughs>
Welcome to this commentary guys, it's going to be a fairly short commentary, I only got about a minute of workout footage on this video just because it was a full day of eating and I wanted to keep the video as that. But I did want to record a little bit because I know you guys enjoy seeing this workout footage, I know you guys like when I put the workouts on the screen, so I'm going to do that for you guys right now. The majority of the workout was arms and then we did a little bit towards the end, uh, a little bit of back movements. Now we did almost all of the back movements we did yesterday were all vertical pulling motions, lat pull down, we did a little bit of pull ups as well. That's because I'm really trying to build the width of my back. Now if you guys are trying to build the thickness of your back, then do a lot of horizontal pulling motions like cable rows, uh, machine rows, bent over dumbbell rows, single arm rows, anything like that. But if you guys are working on the uh, width of your back, a lot of lat pull downs, any vertical pulling motions will help bring out that width. So that's just a personal preference. On my second workout day for back, I do like to do mostly vertical pulling motions. And then my main back day of the week, I like to mix up about half and half, half vertical, half horizontal pulling motions. That's going to wrap up this commentary guys guys very quick like I said hope you guys enjoy the rest of the video and I'll see you soon finish up the workout it is currently 5 12 in the afternoon evening I guess you can say we're here at Jamba Juice we're gonna get a post-workout smoothie uh, we looked at the menu I'm gonna get a make it light smoothie it's like one-third of the calories and carbs so we're gonna go in there and order it and I'll show you guys what I get and what he gets I ended up getting actually we both ended up getting they have like this menu called make it light where it's one-third of the calories actually did I just say that they have this <laughs> All right, I ended up getting a Make It Light Aloha Pineapple Smoothie. I think this only has like 40, maybe even 35 carbs in it. Um, a little bit of protein as well from the Greek yogurt. So we got this post-workout. I'm gonna go home, have a massive meal because I'm really behind on carbs and protein as well. And I'll show you guys what I end up eating. It was a good workout overall though. Arms feel really pumped right now, so that's awesome. Austin's going to his house, picking up clothes, and then dropping me off at the car, and then I'll be home. 6.45 in the evening right now. I am downstairs cooking 225 grams of turkey, ground turkey, 93.7, 150 grams of rice, which is about 120 grams of carbs, and then I have some veggies cooking down there as well. I'm gonna put them on the screen right now for you guys. While I'm waiting for that, I am eating a bowl of cereal, which is about three servings of multigrain Cheerios, about 60, 72 grams of carbs, I think, are in here. So I'm just eating this right now, kind of like a post-workout snack while I'm waiting for my dinner to actually be done cooking. Uh, I just came up here real quick because I had to respond to an email, and I'm going to go back downstairs right now, finish cooking, and I'll see you guys in a little bit. This is it, guys. This is what it looks like. I got a serving of broccoli, 225 grams of turkey right there, and then underneath I have 150 grams of rice. So this meal just right here is 56 grams of protein, 17 grams of fat, 120 grams of carbs, and my total for today so far is 158 protein, 68 fat, and 390 grams of carbs. I actually already started this morning. I'm gonna start editing the video that you guys are seeing actually today, this video right here. So I'm gonna do that. I have some emails and then probably check in with you guys later tonight around probably a couple more hours, probably 9.30 or 10 o'clock. I'll see you guys again. 9.18 at night, 9.19 now. I am in the parking lot outside of 24 Hour Fitness. I'm about to go inside, do about 20, 20 to 25 minutes of cardio. I haven't done cardio in like a few days. This is very, very light intensity. And then Chipotle is literally in on this, so 24 is right here, Chipotle is on this side of the parking lot. So I'm literally gonna walk over after the gym, after my cardio session, and grab some Chipotle. It does close at 10 though, so I have about 40 minutes. So it shouldn't be a big deal at all because I'll probably be done around 9.45 and then head straight there and hopefully it'll still be open. So that's the plan right now guys. I'll check in with you guys after the gym and I'll let you know how cardio went. It is 9.55 at night right now. It closes in five minutes. I have a few friends that I just saw outside of the gym going there as well. So I'm gonna meet some friends there. Probably grab the usual Chipotle bowl, but I'll let you guys know. Cardio was awesome. I did 25 minutes on the treadmill. I went to Chipotle with some friends and I didn't want to record in front of them. So I just got a quick shot of what I ate, but it was the usual. I got double rice, chicken, black beans, medium salsa, lettuce, and that was pretty much it. So I am currently at find this piece of paper oh I threw it away no oh I threw away the piece of paper I thought it was my receipt I threw away the paper that actually had everything listed but I do remember what I wrote down so right now after Chipotle 206 grams of protein 82 grams of fat and 497 grams of carbs so I'm gonna have another big meal probably in about hour probably in about an hour I'm gonna go shower right now work on some stuff on my laptop and then have the last meal of the night which I will show you guys so I'll see you guys inside 
It's 11.55 at night. I'm about to head the bed probably in about 30 minutes, but before that I have to finish the last meal of the day. Now this looks like a lot. I guess it kind of is a lot of food. <laughs> I am very hungry right now though. So we're looking at, this is what I went into before this uh, meal right here. So we're looking at 44 grams of protein left, 20 grams of fat left, and 105 grams of carbs left. So the first thing I did looking at this was I knew I needed a high carb, something high carb, which the first thing I grabbed was these bagels, which is going to be about 50 grams of that 105. So this entire meal right here, I have one everything bagel, which is this right here, one chocolate rice cake, one regular rice cake with 15 grams of peanut butter on it or half a serving. I have one serving of Greek yogurt and inside that Greek yogurt right there is this granola stuff right here. So all this added up is 43 grams of protein, 18 fat, and 117 grams of carbs, totaling 249 grams of protein for the day, 100 grams of fat for the day, 612 carbs for the day, equaling 4,344 calories. So that's gonna wrap up this video, guys. I probably, I still have to get a thumbnail, so I'm probably gonna leave all this stuff out right here, take a thumbnail picture, eat this, and then head off to bed. Thank you guys for watching. If you guys did enjoy this video, drop a like, it would really help me out. I'm so close to 10,000 subscribers. I can't wait, I'm very excited for it. I'll see you guys in the next video.